Are you a student looking to enhance your coding skill, collaborate with others and build an online portfolio? Today we are diving into a must have tool for students and developers, GitHub. So what exactly is GitHub? In simple terms, GitHub is a platform that allows students, developers to store, manage and collaborate on projects, all while keeping track of every change made to the code. It's built on top of JIT, which is a version control system that helps manage different versions of your code. Whether you are working on a solo project or collaborating with others, GitHub has got your back. Git has code behind GitHub, helps developers and everyone manage changes to their code over time. Think of it like a super organized folder that tracks every update allowing you to go back in time if you make a mistake. Trust me, it's a lifesaver. But GitHub isn't just for professionals. If you are a student, hear how you can use GitHub to level up your skill. First one, you can do a version control for your project. GitHub allows you to track every single changes in your project. So no more messy folders like project final, final version 2, project version 2, project version 3 like that. You can collaborate on group projects. If you are working on a group project, GitHub makes it easy for you and your teammates to work together seamlessly without overwriting with each other's code. Watch till the end, I'm going to show you how to create your GitHub page and also subscribe to my channel for more such videos for you. So all, almost this particular playlist, skill up playlist will be helpful for you where I'll be updating about the internship opportunities, job opportunities uh, and uh, free courses like skilling up for the students, AI websites and AI tools for the students. So watch this and also if you have any queries, if you want any personal guidance from me like how to prepare for your future like a certification readiness or if you how, how to um, get ready for the interview, interview preparation tips and tricks and if you want me to conduct a mock interview for you. So resume review everything i can do it for this for your career and technology so watch till the end where i'll be discussing you how to create it so this github will allows you to build a portfolio github is an excellent platform to showcase your work whether it's personal project or assignments a well organized github profile is a great way to show off your skill to future employers Learn by contributing to open sources. You can even contribute to open source projects, learning from real world code and collaborating with developers from all over the world. And here's is a bonus for a student. GitHub offers a student developer pack, giving you access to tons of free tools to grow your skill. So now let us try. We'll go and create a new GitHub account for you. So what you have to do is what just go to github.com slash login so i'll be leaving this link in the description or the pin comment you can go and check that so here you can find create an account just click on that to create your account so once if you click there you can see how to create an account you have to enter your email id so just give your email id and once if your email id is valid you can just click continue and then you have to click your password you have to select your password once your password is strong you can click continue and it will ask you for your username so you can just tell what is the username you want so once your username is fine if it is available so you can just simply select their username and then if you want to receive the occasional product updates and announcement you can select this if you don't want this you can unselect this and click continue it's very simple as we create an account so it will ask you to verify your account so what you have to do you have to just um, solve the puzzle here so it is i think it's loading okay so this is your um, uh, this is a hand it is showing so you have to change this like a hand okay 
just like let us try to summit this i think one is done and it's allowing me to get in so now it will be uh, sending a one time password to your email id to which email id you have given so you have to open the email id and get it here okay just uh, open your email id which mail id you have given so you can just launch it so if you want more um, uh, more tutorials on github you know you can simply uh, tell me you can leave the comment i will definitely help you so this is my uh, code i received so once you enter the code it will ask you to log in with your email id and the password so i can use my username and then the password which i have given and click sign in so you are now here okay so how to describe yourself or your student or a teacher or what so you can select here if you are a student if you are a teacher you can select that as well now how many members will be working with you in the team so if you are only one you are going to uh, go with then you can just tell just me and if you are going to work with 2 to 5 you can tell that uh and if like based on your team member size okay so just click continue you can select the team member size and what are the top two things you want to do with the github so i want to start a new project use a github copilot so github copilot is an exciting thing which is there in the github so we will be discussing about that so don't worry um and click continue so you are uh, it will show you that this is your uh, free which is unlimited unlimited public and private repositories you can do this 500 mb storage all these things and then the team if you want to connect with the team you can also do that just go ahead with i want to create a github page so yes boom you are here so you can start creating a repository actually what is a repository which is used to store your data like how we can organize it so you can create my demo uh, repository or my first repository okay and you have to choose whether it is a pub public one or a private one so if you wanted to show it to everyone you can go ahead with public or else you can make it as private and click create new repository of course you can also change it later okay but it's just you can go ahead and create it and this is your git github and everything so if you want to create a new one it's easy to create a new repository okay and you have an option here get set up github copilot so just click get started so you have a 30 days free trial it's really it's really very fun okay so just to give go and get the access to that so it's due today and you have to pay that after 30 days okay so they'll be asking you these details you can provide this and save it for the future uh, future thing okay so you can just give what is the name and uh, what is the address and everything but if you don't want to try now you can just uh, make it as like you can just explore how to create i will show you how to use the github copilot uh, in the next video probably if you want it soon just comment github copilot i'll be showing it soon uh if you just go ahead and understand what is this this is your home page that is the learn with gomes and so here you can see lot of things like uh, what is your organization if you want to change the uh, image you can also change that and everything goes here okay and if you wanted to create a repository it's easy to create a repository so you can click here and see you have a demo repository if you want to create a new one you can click here and create a new one okay and then you can store your data share it with your friends and everything so this is what all about the github like how to create an account in github it's very easy to do that as you see okay so um uh, you have to learn by doing it okay by using github you will gain hands on experience with git one of the most important tool in modern software development follow other developers so you can just search for the other developers who are using it you can also contribute to the github open source project and you can keep all your projects your resume everything in the github where else you can share this and if you are using if you want to share your project with your uh, hr or the recruitment team you have to make it as a public and you can copy the link and keep it in your resume okay they'll be really excited to see that you have a github account as well so whether you are working on a class project building a coding portfolio or contributing to the open source github is the perfect place to start 
get coding and let github take you the next level thanks for watching and happy coding i'll meet you soon with the next exciting video thank you take care and bye bye